guys and welcome to another vlog. Uh, the reason why Aishan has not said a single word in the intro is because he is scared. Because we are gonna cut. I mean, I am gonna cut his hair. <laughs> what do you have to say, Aishan? Do you have something to say? Just don't mess it up. super long right now as you can see it's been about like maybe two or three months since i've cut it's been a really long time how often do you cut your hair otherwise i try to do it once a month but it's been three months so far so i think right now we're just gonna do a simple trim i used to cut my hair my own hair back in college as well as some of my friends hairs so i know what i'm doing i'm gonna just guide you do we read the sides first so do like a five up like here towards the back. Just go like this. No, 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 no. Upwards, upwards. Like this. Just do this. That is not gonna cut off the I know, I don't want it to. done something self-destructive in quarantine yet so why not do it now <laughs> just kidding i've been planning to do this for a while and i even ordered the things in but then the whole plan has not been falling into place for a while like, but today i was like you know what i'm doing this this is happening so as you can tell from the title i'm going red i used to have red hair before actually but that was professionally done and I think Chetan, my hairdresser, I miss him the most. Uh, I don't let anyone touch my hair. Like, nobody. Nobody other than him. So, yeah, who is the next person I trust after him? <laughs> I don't trust myself at all. I'm coloring my hair red at home. So, you can judge my decision making skills based on that. So, this is uh, my setup without even like starting. It's already so dirty. I haven't even started. I don't know how I am this messy. For today's video, I'll be using two of these. These are the go-to hair dye if you want to color your hair red. The L'Oreal High Color highlights for dark hair basically. And this is in the shade Magenta. And I also have an extra, it's like a red color booster. And then I have this pokey comb for my partitions. This is my scrunchie with a lot of hair in it. Thanks to hair fall and stress. Um, this is the container I'll be using. And this is the 30 volume developer that I have. And I have some foils here ready to go. I tried to order the utilities that for DIY like hair coloring kit and everything on Amazon. But then they were taking too long to deliver. So when I went for my groceries this time, what I thought was I'll buy a cheap box dye which comes with an applicator. I found this one and I thought thought that like look at that that looks like a proper applicator but 
just like my luck has been working out lately. Uh, this is what it is. It comes with this, so I have to attach this dhakkan on this, but this has product in it, and I'm not trying to color my hair. Medium ash brown shades. No, thank you. I'll try to use it to like blend it in, but this is like going to be very uncomfortable. And I'm going to be using this to mix the color in it because, as I said, it's taking too like too long to come. So my baby spinach container. CEO of Megan Do, guys, Queen of Jugal. Yeah, and for the technique, I saw a lot of videos, and plus I paid attention when. <laughs> Every time I think of my hairdresser Chetan. By the way, Gore Gao, uh, he and me once Miss Corona decides to leave us. You can go check him out. He is a magic. He is literal magic. He's the best. I'm scared, very scared. This can go completely south. But yeah, I've seen him do it, and then I've paid attention to the technique. I think if not very good, I'm pretty decent when it comes to like following, like seeing and learning. So I hope this turns out as expected. If not, I'm just gonna color my whole. Because there's no other way of correcting this. The ultimate goal for today's video is not ending up on Brad Mondo's channel. Because then I'll know that I have failed miserably, miserably. Let's see how this goes, and I'm very excited. So without wasting any more time, let's get right into it. So I'll be using the gold vaseline so that the color doesn't touch my skin. I'm sorry, as I said in my last video, our tripod has broken. Okay, so the tagline is good, guys. So that it doesn't stain your scalp or touch you at all. So the look that I'm trying to achieve is an ombre ish. तो अच्छे से हमने वैसलीन तो लगा दिया है ठीक है अब कलर लगा भी तो निकल जाएगा दिस इज कम्प्लीटली विदाउट ब्लीच इट्स जस्ट कॉन्ट बी दिस अभी टाइम में मत कर मत कर आम वर्कआउट के लिए बहुत अच्छा है बाहर तो नहीं आ रहा One good thing that came out of the box dye that I bought is they had gloves. But please tell me this: Why do they make these gloves so huge? Please, क्या ये? Why is this so big? किसके हाथों के लिए बना रहे हैं? कौन है ये लोग? लोग. Okay, so after sucking a lot at math and wrecking my brain, this is 1.2 fluid ounces each tube, and the ratio of the developer should be one is to two. For each tube, it has to be 2.4 fluid ounces. I have measured around 4.8 fluid ounces of the developer. I still don't know if it is correct, but we're going for it. And I'm going to be using a fork to mix it. The developer is in, and now I'm just gonna add a little bit of the red color booster. So that there's that pop of red in my thing. Make sure like all the chunks have left completely. This looks like a bat of a red velvet cake. So after a lot, a lot, like literally 20 to 30 minutes of mixing, the mixture is ready. It still has a few small chunks, but my arm is gonna fall off if I mix more. 
So we're gonna get started. So for the partition, I'm gonna take a center part all the way to the back, and I'm gonna make two more partitions behind my ear. So this is gonna be one, and this is gonna be the other one. I have four sections. So I will be touching these. Look like an idiot. So we're gonna need some bobby pins to like secure your hair in place. So I'm gonna start from the back. This front hair I'm gonna be extra careful with. So this should didn't be in your hair for more than for more than like forty five minutes. I guess I'm not sure. Let me just check. <laughs> no 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 <laughs> So after the application of the color she kept it for like 20 minutes or more after I apply the whole thing I'm gonna keep it for 20 20 minutes more but we have to work really fast now otherwise it will be like one side is more red than the other and we don't want that you sure don't want that so yeah, let's get started. So I want to do the foil thing, but I don't know how it's gonna work out. I'm gonna do it till the chin level. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna this is literally me figuring it out as we go. So I'm not gonna get the whole hair. I'm gonna leave some sections. Will be alternate sections throughout the hair. Let's see how that goes. Here goes the first application. Okay, you know what? This thing is not working. I'm just gonna use my hands. I'm just gonna use my hands. Yeah, I'm gonna use my hands. It's just gonna be red for a few days. I'll get over it. Once you reach the part where you wanted to like fade in with the rest of the hair, I'm gonna do this. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place this in the foil and like. Yes. Yes, guys, so this is the technique <laughs> that we're going to apply. Now, we're going to not color this. We're going to move on to the next section. Let's take a bigger section, a little bit of color, saturate. suggest not taking this route because one number two is that I don't know what the f is going on here. Oh, Wow, the accuracy is real, guys. The last piece of foil that I prepared. So I'm gonna keep this for about 20 minutes. It took me almost an hour to do this. Guys, please don't use your hands because it's itching me like a bitch. I don't know what I've done. So, and it has stained my nails even. <laughs> this is bad. 
this is bad this is very bad so i went ahead and like saturated all my tips it's been 10 minutes since in another 5 i'm going to go have a bath i'll come back with the results is it fair looking very very uneven so let me just style it and then i'll get back to you okay so i styled my hair guys honestly i feel i don't know yet how i feel about this it turned out better than i expected i mean you guys saw the whole process that was not the most optimal, optimal way, way of, of doing, doing things. things the stains came out though but my nails are ruined forever as you saw for yourself that this red dye stained my soul as well but uh, i like this it's subtle it's nice there is no harsh line that was my only concern to be honest Yeah and I will also insert a video of how it looks like a clip of how it looks in the sunlight it's going to be more vibrant than this but yeah this is the final product of our chaotic process because the color didn't do enough damage to my hair i decided to blow dry it and then do these curls with the straightener Yeah, I am not known for my best decision making skills. But that's it for today's video guys. I hope you enjoyed and um, I'll see you guys next time when I'm doing something else self destructive. Bye bye.